what's going on? This is Siler, and these are five warp twin slips. So I would say to begin with, which I'm pretty sure everyone always uh, puts it, this one in here, is water. Can't stress that enough, like you have to stay hydrated. Like it's pretty crazy because even people that love drinking beer, it's almost like here on a bus, it's harder to find water than it is to find beer. And, and I know it sounds crazy. Yeah, so it's way easier to fall into the beer drinking all day because there's just so much of it everywhere. Yeah. And by the end of the night, you realize you didn't drink any water all day. You just drank beer since you woke up. So yeah, and stay hydrated. Cool. Stay hydrated. Uh, another one: wake up early, hit the porta potties before everybody else. You wait. It's, they've been sitting in the sun all day. Everyone on the tour has been using them. You do Dude, not want to go inside. Of I can't tours. even explain to you guys what I've seen in those porta potties past like 4 p.m. Uh, not it's only, crazy. And not only that, but they're also 100 degrees hotter inside yeah, of them than yeah, they are yeah. outside. It's crazy. You'll step out at like Arizona, 115 degrees, and it feels like there's feels a breeze nice outside, outside the port potty after you've been in there. So you definitely want to catch <laughs> it early. I think it's very crucial to wake up early as well, not just for the port potties, but like, I don't know, just to get your day started, get your brain moving. You don't know if you're going to play first that day. You know what I mean? I, you definitely don't want to get woken up by your tour manager, like, hey, dude, you're on stage in an hour. Like, that's awful. So I'd say wake up early, you know, be ready to go and just find out what's going on around you for the rest of the day. Uh, definitely extra utensils. Yes. Tons and tons and tons of utensils. It's crazy because uh, they get used like crazy. What was like the first week when we first got in, we bought like these two massive boxes. And I think someone dropped a comment and it was just like, hey, you guys are good for the rest of the tour. And I was like, dude, no <laughs> way. <laughs> sure enough, we, we ran out be before week. the next stop. Yeah. So that's crucial. Also, a lot of toilet paper. You should toilet paper. You never know what you might need in an emergency. Yeah. It's crazy. Um, some, I've been to venues where none of the board of hotties yes, have toilet that's paper. that's true. That's true. And then you don't know what to do. And then bring baby wipes. No, why not? That always helps, too. Yep. And I think uh, one of the biggest ones is make friends, dude. Straight up. It's like, it's it's summertime. It's nice out. You're playing, you're playing sick shows. There's a lot of sick people out there. And, you know, just make friends. Have a good time. Make the best out of that summer, which is Absolutely. what we're doing right now. So yeah, those are five tips on Warp Tour.